Okay, let me start out with saying I'm sorry for the whole Blair Witch selfie project going on right now. I'm sorry. I'm all alone. The camera crew's working a different job, so I'm going to have to do this by myself. I'm going to drop down a few tiles. We may even spin right through a whole set. At least that's what I'm hoping for. I'm going to get a whole set, and I'm going to get as fast as I can. I'm going to get them over here on this drying table. I got my cups out. Got them set up in sets. So I got one, two, three, four coasters, one trivet. One, two, three, four coasters, one trivet. Trivet's working nice on these little cups. Had to move everything else out of my way over there. Get it out. Those are all done. On that end, they're totally done, ready to go to customers. These ones are just, you know, doing their drying a couple weeks, getting them nice and cured, and then I can resin them. I'm gonna have to do the whole Blair Witch selfie thing. I should get a bunch of tears going on. <laughs> but what we're gonna do, we're gonna drop you on this canvas over here. Got my spinner out. I got one four inch tile on there. I have to put a little pillow thing under here because it ain't sticking right now. We'll set you up here. Make sure you are got a good view going on. And let's see. One further right there about. That way you can see what's up. Try to get this uh, mapped out with my fingers. Let's see. My index fingers work perfect to put this thing right in the middle. See. Oh, it's got to be a little bit over that way. I'm going to push it. That's what my index fingers do. They put that thing as close to center as I can. Not that one of my fingers might not be longer than the other, but I'm gonna put down a little pillow. So once I mix my pillow, I put my pillow in this little jug from Home Depot. You can just buy this little jug. It's easier to work with. So I'm slap down a little pillow. A little B-leaves pillow, you know, a little skinny pillow. Spread it out to his edges here. Get her about there. So you got paint on, you know, like each corner and just kind of filtering outward. Get my paper towel ready. One thing I noticed is, let's pick you back up here a second. I feel like Charlie Brown. I don't know, I'm gonna have to start watching more videos with other people doing this, but I feel like Charlie Brown. You ever watch Charlie Brown? I mean, Charlie Brown always got the same clothes on. He's always got the same clothes. Lucy's always got the same clothes. Pigpen's always got the same clothes. Everyone's got the same clothes on. I think they were all doing paintings. Because I am always in this. This is what I'm in. That's it. That's my painting clothes. I don't get to wear nothing else. Wife is like, oh no. They, uh, mm. they, you, you, you go put your painting clothes on. So, uh, Charlie Brown, man. I should put the little stripe down here like Charlie Brown. That's what I feel like. Stick you here, back on here. We're gonna try to turn this light on. That's on this stand, see if it helps at all. Just to give it a little different feel, maybe. Eh, ew, I don't like that one. How about the soft one? Mm, yeah, and the blue? Yeah, no. I just don't think I need it with this thing overhead. I don't know, maybe. Yeah, we'll give it a shot. To me, like, it makes a little shadowy effect. But I don't know. Need to find a way to get this camera right over top of me. There's some of you like my buddy, Mr. Frost. If you watch this video, how do you get that camera view right above this thing? I need to know. What, what'd you rig up? I want to see how you rigged it up. I can't get my stand to go right over top. Put it in the comments, man. Need on top. Some people won't see on top. So we're going to give her a shot here. Spin this pillow out a little bit. I put my shield up. Do the Captain America and put my shield up in front of me. Just a little spin, get that pillow filtered outward. And hopefully we make magic time. The other way here. Just get my pillow all over the top of the surface here. With a little coaster like this, I don't, I don't think you need this big blobby pillow in the center. I don't know. I'm, I'm sure I'm doing it wrong. I, I didn't take the CV art course. No. Mm -mm. I, I'm sure there's a reason for this big puddle here, but I can't figure it out. And if I can't figure it out, I ain't going to do it, man. You tell, tell me, am I supposed to take this CV art course? Are they going to teach me something? I'm going to get a little 
knowledge out of that or something. I just don't feel it. But if someone says like has taken and they're like, yeah, you need to take that, man. You silly. You messing up. You take that course. Just give them their money. Get, just give them the money. Drop this peacock feather down. Unfortunately, y'all are gonna have to. The last video is my mixing video. It was long, man. It was long. It was like work. I thought I was. I could collect unemployment off how long that thing was. But you all watch that video. You'll you'll see all the colors I mixed. You'll see my pillow being mixed. You'll see my pulling medium being mixed. Everything being mixed. And then right at the very end, of course, I messed up and I bumped the stop button so you couldn't see me continue. So now we're downstairs in the studio. I'm going to do a, another video of me just using the colors that we mixed up in the recipe video. And we're just going to hopefully bang out a whole set. One set. We're going to do one set. I will, from here on forward, I'm not going to talk so much. And I know most of you are like, just shut up already, man. We don't just paint, man. Paint. Old peacock feather. Put some of that in the middle. I love this color too. Woo, boy. That is some sparkly, magical stuff. Put some of this. This is this little piggy sequence going on right here. Just drizzle, drizzle. Put some in the middle, but drizzle, drizzle. That's what I'm talking about. Get them multicolored cells. Because we just mixed all this up today, there's going to be some bubbles plaguing us that need to get evicted. Boop, boop, boop. And we'll have to hit some stuff with the torch. We're going to be doing that a bunch. This is the same. What's, what's resin just, like, I, I'm literally calling it that. This is unicorn turds, man. This is so beautiful, it's like unicorn turds. Get some of it right in the middle and then squiggle, squiggle. So far, this fuchsia one, that's my favorite color. Oof, that's nasty cool. Get some of that in there. <clears throat> Gonna take some of that gold you saw me mixed up in the mixing video. Get that squiggled around. A little in the middle. I'm gonna take that FX mutant. I'm put some of this mutant, or mutant shift. Squiggle that around. It don't matter if you put some over here. Just put it over here too. It don't matter. Some here. Some of that violent, or violet, that yeah, violent violet, nice, I like that, I'm going to make that color, how about that? This is some of that interference from Bling It, it's that violet interference color, put a little squiggle in the middle. This here is my color art, Christmas red, this is the old pink color, You're right here in the center especially, so it's right underneath that cell activator. Some little squiggles here. I'm gonna go with that black cell activator you watched me do in the uh, mixing video. Go right in the middle with that. Put some of that right smack in the way. Well, you know, some bubble needs to get evicted first. Right in a red bad spot. Yeah, you don't need to. You don't need to poke her. Bye bye, Mister. So of course, you know, a couple days from now, the pouring medium, the bubbles will calm down, they'll come up the top and they'll pop, so there won't be all these little pesky bubbles everywhere. It's not even really so much the pouring medium. The pouring, pouring medium most times seems fine, it's that pillow under there, it's got bubbles all over it from mixing it, and you gotta mix it. Drop some of that down. You can already see that nice little halo we're looking for. It's beautiful. Don't let it sink too far. Mix this up a little bit. Just to wake it up, say hello. We're about to make some beauty. Whee! Come on. Get in here. Get this white. 
that's making a halo up against the black, so that's a good sign. Take the world's largest leaf blower. I mean, I almost need a backpack for this. That's, that's enormous, man. Don't cover up the whole exhaust either. I've done this before and it started doing goofy stuff. Don't do that. You don't want, don't want to be on top of that. There you go. Get this blowing out here. Cut that cell up the way across the top of these covers. Dig it in a little bit. Cut it across. Dig it in. Cut it across. Dig it in. Cut it across. Dig it in. And dig it in. Dig it in. Dig it. And then when I dig it. <laughs> Get you some cells. Woo, boy. Maybe a little too much weight cell activator, but man, let that collect up. That's gonna be that's gonna be as magical as that test blob, boy. Look at this. I can't see what you guys are seeing when I do this. I try to here. Look at that, man. That's lots of cells. Yeah. I'm gonna blow some of this out with my mouth. It's a little got a little too much stuff going on in certain spots here. Blow it out here towards the edges. We all know what's next. Brandon Lee got to draw him some hearts up in here. <clears throat> With that pillow paint close, man. The black is surrounding that white perfectly in here. Up inside of some of these, they're perfect white lacing, black surrounding. Then there's like the purple flash or that mutant flash or mutant, the mutant color from my other video mixing. Mutants or something, zombie mutant apocalypse, whatever. And then there's the green for the peacock feather inside of that even. I mean, come on now. Dang, man. Woo. Let's not get it too distorted here. Take this uh, skewer, find me a couple spots to just whoop, whoop, draw some little hearts up in here. I draw hearts. You love your pain, it's gonna love you right back, man. A little heart there, a little heart there. Yeah, just little hearts everywhere. We love them. And we'll, we'll give it some spinny doo da. <clears throat> I think I had a little too much pillow, but let's find out. Get these colors so none of this wants to spin inside this cup here that I got that's a little close. I'm just gonna give it a light spin. I know it don't look like that on the camera, but that's just a light spin, man. A little baby spin. I don't want too much of this to distort. I like it. It's nice. Slow her down really slow like. Come the other way. Hey, you know, doing the spin torch right now. Spin torch. Boy, let me tell you what. Let me give her one more clockwise sort of spin here. Those are lighter spins than I used to do, or I usually do. I usually give her a good spin, but I don't want too much of this going anywhere. And my pillow's thin, thin enough, I'm pretty sure. So, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's nice. <clears throat> I'm gonna pick up the camera. I'm gonna get you like a right on top of here. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. All right, nice. This corner stayed a little like I would. I would most time want to spin that out, but I'm not messing with it, man. I don't want to lose any more of this, and it's not. It's not moving, so we're good. It's nice.
That's very nice. Take my skewer here though. I do see that corner needs just a little bit of this color added here. So when I pick it up, each corner has actual paint on it. And that's pretty good. It's pretty good. Yeah, that's uh, that's beautiful right there. Woo! Can't wait to get a picture of that one. <coughs> Excuse me. There's one little spot right here. Take this beauty over to the drying table, right? right. Oh, that <laughs> that interference violet took that black cell activator and turned it this deep, nice purple. Woof. That's beautiful. So there's one. We'll go. We'll just go fast. I'm gonna wipe these drips off this bottom side so it ain't pulling on the entire painting. We don't want to lose any of this. Leave them drips there, the weight of that drip will pull on the top of the paint, or on the top of the paint that's on the top, I should say. And we don't want that happen. We want to leave this nice like it is right now. Mm -hmm. It's loving my eyeballs. It's just sparkly. Woo. It's pretty. Yeah, that's real pretty. Yeah. Yeah. I know you can't see much like that. But I'm just going to roll through these four and the one trivet really fast. Then I'll take pictures <clears throat> of all of it and, and I'll post those on these various Facebook groups I'm in and on regular Facebook. You know, I'll see them. Put this little buddy over here on the drying table. Drying counter. Nice. Yeah. There's a nice one. Take this and just smear this around. That way that next tile has a little bit of stick to it. Go like that there. And then do the same thing here. Take my index fingers and push it in here and find out exactly the center. You don't need a tape measure. You just use your guide gave man. You use these fingers. This is really close. Get some paper towel ready. So that towel sticks good. I may be using a little too many colors. I think the next set, with four coasters and one trivet, I'm gonna slim some of these colors out of here. I'm not sure which colors I'm gonna maneuver out. Maybe the gold. And the interference, maybe. But for now, we're rolling. Yeah. Just a... Oh my gosh! I was I was going for the moon with that pillow. Holy cow! <laughs> you don't need that much for five paintings. Woo. Man, let me tell you what. We we'll just move that over here. God dang it! Woo. We're definitely gonna have to spin this out. We're gonna have to spin this out and have some paper towel already. This is gonna go everywhere. Great. Pillow heavy. Like I wanted to go nine nine and needed my pillow. Great. This paper towel clean that business out of there. Might even have to take this here and get this out of my way. Whew. Way too much pillow. <clears throat> Excuse me. Too much pillow for my liking, anyway. Won't be bad now. Right, here we go. Same order. I'm just gonna go fast, try to bang these out. Excuse me again, I got a little tickle in the back of my throat. I must need more of that Cabernet Red. That's what I think. A lot of paint built up on my table over here. I'm 
some of that unicorn turd. Fuchsia unicorn turds. Nice. I don't know what else to compare it to. Drapers. Beautiful. The color is just magical, man. It hits that. It hits that other color, and I mean, whew, man. I tell you what. Some gold. Squiggle, squiggle, squiggle. And that mutant. FX mutant poop. There you go. Everything's about turd now. You know, puts on some mutant turds. Don't overpower it. Look at that. Violet flash or violet interference color here. I bling it. I just gotta go faster, man. I gotta go faster. Just red right under that cell activator and then spin it down here a little bit. That opaque color right underneath your activator. And the last one seemed like it had a little too much white activator. I'm looking at it right now. I mean, it don't look bad. It ain't bad. That ain't bad. But that should be enough. Let that sink just a tad, a couple seconds or so. Do your little magic fingers, and abracadabra. And so this is beautiful. Let's torch it quick. I do see quite a few little bubbles going on here. Just a little bit of torching. A little bit of this giant hair blower, leaf blower, or whatever. Oof. As I was doing that, it was making cell. The white was making cells on top of the black. That was cool. I have a windy dream in colors. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you very much. Do your job. Yeah. Ooh, wee, man. I'm going to lose some of the coolest stuff is right here, man. I'm going to lose that, too. Dang it. That's nice right here. Oh. Gotta remember to not do this too or I touch it. You're not supposed to touch it. Let that collect up a little bit. Blow these edges a little bit. Not that I need it too much. I had plenty of pillow on this thing. I do too much over there, that's for sure. Yeah, I like that peacock feather, people. That peacock feather is a, a real nice color. Give me some. Oh, uh, I'll blow this out a little better. That'll work. It's all. That's gonna come flying off of there anyway. Let's get a couple spots where I can find a heart somewhere. That one worked out. That was nice. Throw it down. Right down through this black. I'll bet you. Oh, yes, very nice. Yes, yeah, very nice. <clears throat> mm -hmm. Ugh. That is some beautiful stuff. Gonna have to uh, spin real slow. Uh, I'm hoping this stuff over here kind of. I, I would hope I can save some of that. I'd like more of this to come plopping off, but I, I find if I tilt, it starts to get wonky over here and like stretch them all goofy. And I got my tile pretty close to the center, so hopefully, just slowly spinning, I can get it to just spread. Looks very cool right now, though. Love that peacock feather, man. That's, that's a nice color. It's so deep. I got enough paints to paint all night long. Go counterclockwise, man. That is that's nice right there. Just want that one corner to fall off, hopefully. Slow her down a little bit. 
Yeah, I want this one. <clears throat> I want this one corner to come off. That's all I'm looking for. This corner right here. It's got one Karen from Waterfall acrylic called the bikini corner. But I I don't see why that's a problem. I like bikinis, so I, I'm not gonna call it that. <laughs> that's a that's a problem corner. That's what I'm gonna call it. <laughs> you, ain't nothing wrong with a bikini. The way it is for her, those bikini corners are a bad thing. I go, no, no thank you. I guess because I'm a guy, I don't know what a guy would call it. Something that a guy doesn't like. Uh, I don't know. That's the crochet corner? I don't know. <laughs> I'm almost going to have to help it. <clears throat> I need some of this purple from over here. If we can get that to just lay on top of this corner. Which it did very nicely. And hopefully we can just take up inside of here. Scribble a little heart and drop it right through it. I know it's about to fling off. But it will help. I don't want to go too fast. I don't want to lose any of this. This thing is... Man, the past couple days I've been getting my new favorites, I call them. <clears throat> this, one, this one might be my next new favorite. Just thick with these cells are nice in this area. Ooh, boy, let me tell you what. I'm have to learn the swipe stuff better, too. I see these people doing these swipes, and it just looks phenomenal when they're done. So this is... I got to give you a look at this thing. Let me see this. Do you all see that? You see that purple mixing up with that... Oh man, I just don't even know how to describe that business. <laughs> Got a little lackluster up here in this corner, but man, what? Okay, what? What? Oh, my goodness. Oof. Okay, enough messing around. We gotta hurry up. I'm gonna bust out this whole set. Get this thing off the table here. My gosh, dang. Wow. That is, that's top shelf right there, Bobby. That's that textbook beauty right here. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm serious about this. Do I need to take this CDR course? I need to know. Do I, am I supposed to take this thing? I don't. I don't need to be just in their secret club. I, I mean, do I need to take it to like? improve what I'm doing or something. I don't know. I I don't know. It's like some secret society. They don't they don't let you know anything unless you pay this person money. You don't pay person money? For what? What? Yeah, we pay teachers. That's what that is that what I'm gonna hear? Yeah, you pay teachers? Man. Well that's without the sheet there of course, just so you know. Right there. That's just paying attention is all that is. Mm-hmm. Paying attention to what's happening. That's beautiful. Whew. Not saying against, anything against people who have taken that course, man. Don't get me wrong. I'm just saying, I mean, do I need that course? Do I need that course for something? Is it going to give me something? I don't know. <laughs> Someone, one, one of you people, you put that in the comments and be like, yeah, man, you take that course because pff, it's going to teach you this. It'll be a lot better. If you take that course, because you don't know this. Oh, okay. And I'll take it. I'll take it. I ain't kidding you. If someone tells me some super intelligent stuff of why I should take that course, I'll take it, man. I'll take it quick. God gives me permission to use some sort of stuff. I'll just use it. Here we go. Need two more four inches. Over the table over here, one more six inch trivet. Put that on the corner over here so it's ready. Drop this here like this. Boom, boom, bam. We're gonna do another one quick, man. That's what's up. We're gonna wait almost. Try to try to get this bad boy centered with your fingers. Like I said, maybe one of my fingers is longer than the other, but I doubt it. Pretty good right here. 
getting good at just slapping that thing right center. <clears throat> Drop that pillow again. This time we're gonna try not to go overboard here. Pushed out. So we cover all these edges here. Yeah, then we're gonna do it, man. You don't have to spinny do die. Come on, little spinny table. Take my Captain America shield again in front of me. Do a little spin here to thin out this pillow. Thin it out nice, thin it out nice. Ooh, that's right the next group I'm gonna try to use a smaller or next set I should say I'm gonna use smaller amounts of paint in the center and I'm gonna leave negative space so that it, I can kind of use my skewer and draw some stuff and make it look more like a flower but that that was not gonna be recorded I'll show you pictures but we'll just record this set Torch on the In the same order, we're just gonna pop these next two quick. Keep saying I'm gonna stop talking, but this time I'm seriously, we're just gonna, we're gonna get through this here. We're gonna keep your eyeballs open. It's gonna be like Bruce Lee, one inch punch. You ain't gonna see it coming. Bam! Colors in, blow it out, spin it out, move on to the next one until we're done with that trivet. Unicorn turds. The next ones, we might start with this uh, Let's Resin Fuchsia Unicorn Turd color first so that it actually turns out like a red, a red ish, I should say painting rather than a greenish from that peacock feather that these are all giving me. A little squeezy squeeze in there, a little skewer this bubble here. Get out of my house. Squiggle, squiggle, squiggle. And that interference violet. Squiggle, squiggle. This red keeps like, I don't want to say getting lost, but it's kind of getting lost. I think I'm putting enough in there, it's just, it's getting lost. Well, I don't think that one's going to get lost. I accidentally put a big old blob right there. Let's see what happens. on that black cell activator. Go a little more of that this time here. And that white right in the center there. Let's see what that gives us. Hit it with a torch really quick. See what we give of that business. Pull this paint away from here so we can get a good look. And 
looking bad. But then, whew, ain't looking bad. Why well, I keep saying that, man? What do you mean ain't looking bad, man? That's awesome. Look at themselves. Jeepers. Let that collect up a little bit and spin it out, dude. Jeez. Well, give me a little. Yeah. Give me a little blown out of them spots there that don't have any cells that are a little boring. Do me a little wrecking with my skewer to find my heart. Put my love in my painting. Look at them, man. Woof. I don't know if the camera's doing it justice. Man, woo -wee. Man. Very purdy. Going out to these edges here. Might even get you. Camera almost fell down. Might even get you some more uh, cells in here. A couple. Man, that is. Goodness for unicorn poop, man. Wow. Dang, that's what I said. Unicorn turds. Woof. We'll get some of this here. Find my place for my hearts. Like that one here. Sometimes they get spun out, but I still put them there because a lot of times they don't get spun out. And people always say, look at the hearts in there. Yeah. That's right. This one here. We're gonna lose some really good stuff right here. This is nice. That's gonna get lost. Some people might say, well, it's not lost yet. Well, yeah, you gotta spin this paint out though. And it's gonna go bye-bye. Yeah. Woof. Thank goodness for unicorn poop. Nice. Should I give you a nice close up again just before I spin this thing? That's some that's what's real nice, dude. That lacing is phenomenal. Ooh-wee. Come on. Give her a spin. I'm really not gonna spin this one on. I don't want to spin too much off of here. Hopefully it comes off this corner. Ah, it's a little faster than I wanted. Slow it down slowly with your finger on top here. Don't push a lot of pressure on this top here. You just barely push. It'll slow it down nicely. Oh. It. It. <laughs> this dry is even close to what it looks like right now. That's going to be my new favorite. I see it right now. It's not moving when I jiggle it. It's not moving when I tilt it. Dang! Oof! We're gonna have to figure out a way. I'm gonna have to take my gloves off. I'm gonna set this one down, take my gloves off, and I'm gonna get a picture of that while the camera's still on. This is. Yeah, that's my new uh, profile pick right here. That's right. Oh, check each corner really quick, I guess. Make sure I got paint on everything. I do. Oof. This is the business, man. Hey. Hey. I'm going to wipe this off underneath really quick. Get these drips off of here. Get that out of there. Get this out of here. Yeah. Oh, my. This is making love to my eyeballs. Someone get some eyeball diapers ready because I'm about to have kids. You know, making my eyeballs pregnant. Oof. Look at that. Ew. Ew, yes. Yes. I'll get over here. Get it on the drying table. Ew. I'm going to take my gloves off. I've left them on this whole time, so we're going to give this thing a little flyby. And we're going to take a picture. Yeah, 
We'll spin you around here so you can see this magic. I mean, it's what? Like that unicorn turd is is all up in your face. Yeah, yummy. We'll have a little look here. Let's see what you think. Go get oh oh oh. If I could get that light right so you could see that action. Ooh boy, bang. That nice right there. Oh, there's a little action. You see that shimmer? You see that shimmer? Oof. Oof. Boy, we're going to have to get a picture of this one. This is going to be my... This is going to be my next line of women's clothing right here. That's going in my gallery for my women's clothing line. Take another one of it. I like about... Of the whole thing, I guess. Oh, there. Oh, yeah. We gotta get a better one. Full on solid, though. Here we go. Oh, yeah. Poof. I got. I tell you, that one's nice. Poof. I'd have to. Uh, I'm gonna yell at the kid, make him go get my. My cord from upstairs. Go get my charger cord. It's plugged into the little base right on the counter. It's got the long gray cord on it. Got two more to make here. We'll see. Get you back in the stand. Hopefully without shutting off. Get you aimed the other way. Aimed back down. Right toward here. That's right. Wait, wasn't that one nice, huh? Yeah. Give me a little napkin stuff here. It brings this charger, we'll have to plug that in quick. I just can't see what the battery power is when I'm recording. There you go, special delivery coming up. Plug this in. Pop him underneath the phone over here. I'm gonna have to uh, pick you up a second here to plug in. I know, it's not the view you want. Two more, one more four inch coaster, and then the six inch trivet. <coughs> Excuse me. I'll wipe this uh, spinner off here quick, get some of that excess paint out of my way. Well, these are turning out nice, huh? That's what I say. Oof. Clearly hitting that zone with that unicorn turd, man. Hey, man. Some of this out of my way. Take me a big old drink of my favorite color. Okay. Let's get busy, y'all. Another one of these. Oh, it's smutsy here. Can't have a paint drop that is starting to dry on top of your fresh canvas because that thing will peel up underneath what you're doing and make you real mad. Trust me, that's from experience. See how close we are in the center. I we look a little bit off on this one. Yeah, that's gotta get pushed over that way. She close. She close. For them acrylics to rest on, a pillow. Shapers. I was too much again. I think we buy it by the gallon, yeah? Spin that out to thin. Touch 
that'll get her done. Same pattern. Got two more. Got this one last four inch coaster and then the six inch trivet. Got my actual paints a little thicker than I used to when I first started. When I first started, they must have been too runny and I had issues, problems, things going on. Now I got that consistency nice and warm, honey ish, as some people say. I almost think it's kind of like a pudding. I mean, that's the consistency of pudding. Maybe not your expensive pudding, because I don't get expensive pudding, because I can't afford expensive pudding. So it's, it's the consistency of cheap pudding. Poor people pudding. Get you some of this unicorn turd up in here. Woo! Well, that color's magic. Gold. A bit of this mutant stuff here. Mutant shift. That's what it's called. Mutant shift. Like the the first shift is over the second shift for the mutants, man. Something. The aliens are first shift, the mutants are second shift. I don't know. Get a healthy, generous little blob of that in the middle. And then this red that I mean I see it doing stuff, but I don't know, man. It's maybe I should just put it right in the center. Let's try that. Cause it's, it's disappearing from everywhere else. Maybe a little squiggly here. Here, here, a little squiggly. Mostly in the middle though, we'll see if that helps. Black cell activator. Like I said, you go watch the video just before this one. It's how I mixed all of this today. The pillow, the pouring medium, the colors, everything. You can see how this magic happens. It's just, I mean, to me, it's magic. Magical unicorn turds. Give that a little drip, drip. Give it a second to uh, do what it does. Hit it with a torch quick. Because of just mixing it today, there are there's quite a few bubbles. And in the pillow, you get you get that pillow having so many of these little bubbles under there. They want to come through this acrylic color. This one should be nice. And it is. It's nice. <laughs> Try to blow some of this black across here. Not that we're not just going to lose that, but we'll get her doing something for now. Everything is out to the corners. Really nice. Let that pillow paint come back underneath these acrylics, man. That's phenomenal. That one, it, it has that red so nice. I mean, this has the red <laughs> real nice. Oof, that came out nice. Ew, we're gonna have to spin slow, people. I don't wanna lose too much of this. 
kind of like it. That's why I kind of like my thin pillows. I don't like that big pillow. You, you end up spending too much of the beauty out of there. That's just my opinion. I'm entitled to my opinion. Or, or the Sealy Art Course will treat me different. Maybe I don't. I don't know. <clears throat> you have to pay for that course, and I'm sure it's smarter and better than what I got going on. All my stuff is free. My knowledge is free. Put me just a, some hearts somewhere in these boring spots. With this one, I may have to come. Oh my gosh! Get over there. Get over there. I'm gonna tilt this one so slightly to make this area filter toward here. I do not want to lose this area. That's some some precious stuff over here. We'll give you a look at it here in a second. We'll get this moved over. Look at that. Uh huh. Looky there. Yeah. Looky there. Looky there. Oh yeah. Dude, we got Celtacular going on today. Woo! Mean, yummy. That's right. If you watch the video before this one, you'll see how I mixed all this stuff to get this beauty to happen, man. Pow, pow, pow. Pow! Some firecrackers up in here. Let's see where you're at. I'll give you a shush. Light spins, man. I'm just super slow. Uh, you can see this. You know my normal spin. I like, hi -ya! Man, this is gonna be slow. Slow, like making barbecue sandwiches, man. You want that stuff to, you want it to go slow. You want it to go slow. Oh, I'm actually gonna do this one spin. I'm gonna try to tilt that one corner back toward the center again. I'm gonna leave this alone and pray it dries nice. I don't even care if it's moving. I can't lose that. Yeah, we can't lose that. We can't lose that. Ugh. It ain't moving much anyway. Oh, we're going to end up with a nice one right there. Wow. Wow. Uh, I don't even care that this corner isn't off of here. I don't care. I really don't care. It's not moving very much. We're gonna torch really quick. I do see some plaguing little beads that need to get evicted quick. It's from that pillow. I mean, you have to mix the pillow well, so there's no way around it. The first few days you get your pillow done, you're, you're gonna have some of it. So I gotta I'm gonna spin one more clockwise and hope this comes out of there. This corner here has just a little bit more white than I want. But I'm serious, it's got to be slow. I may even keep on with the same pattern and the same colors. I don't even think I'm going to change up the pattern. I'm just going to bang out a bunch of these that look just like this. Ugh, more of it came out too. Nice. Ugh, I'm leaving that. My goodness. So yeah, I might be saying this all night long, but just say hello to my new uh, profile pic. <laughs> Wow. Wow. That's crazy right there. Every. Ugh. There are some that are. There's cells within the cells, man. Wow. My goodness. Beavers, creepers. Yeah, say hello to my new profile picture. Actually, one of these from today will be my profile picture, and the other one will be that background one, whatever you call that. I know it ain't your profile picture, but it's something. It's called something. Yeah. Wow. My lord, thank you so much for the opportunity. <laughs> Man, I wish I could tip this right now in your favor, but oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Look at this absolute beauty here. Uh, look at them cells. Man, woo wee! I thank you, Lord Jesus. Amen. I'm serious. I'm praying for that business. Oof. Where else does that come from? I ain't kidding you. Where else does that come from? Man. If. Yeah.
Come on, um, come on, Trivet. This is gonna be nice. Yeah, look at this set already. Oof. Touch the other ones. Oh, yes. <laughs> yes, please. That's nice. Wipe off the hands quick. Wipe off this board quick. And we're gonna do this trivet. Hopefully it even comes out half as decent as them coasters. Man. Half as decent would be a blessing. What are we at right now? We're almost an hour right now doing this set. So we're gonna wrap this up. We're gonna do this last one. We're gonna wrap it up. I'm sorry, I'm trying to go fast, but you know what it's like. You don't wanna I don't want to sacrifice beauty for skimping steps or trying to rush yourself. Get this thing centered here. Put this pillow down. And after this set, I'm going to turn the music on. Oh, look at that little boogity doo dah. What you doing in here? You don't want to get a little dried paint right there from the tub. Yeah. We don't need you here. You'll, you'll get that. You just got to pay attention. You see a little boogie doodah. Pick it. You get a boogie, pick it. <laughs> get out of there. Almost think there might be another one in that center. We'll uh, smear this around. Spin her up a little bit. See if we can get it up toward the edges. If we can, it's go. We're going to get in the plane and go. Let's see what we get here. Definitely saw a lot of bubbles in that uh, pillow. We may have to stab at this spot. It's like, it's got a lump. It doesn't seem like it's a booger. Not just a weird lump. Okay. Do a little bit of this stuff here in this corner, a little bit of this stuff here in this corner, a little bit in this corner, a little bit in this corner, and in this corner, White House man. <laughs> All right. Let's out of here. Let's finish the set, y'all. Dead done. Big old, big old pools this time. Ooh, give me some of this here. Be enough. We're gonna let the spinning magic happen on this one big time. Put some of that this little piggy sequins on here. Ooh, you you're supposed to drag the cup through here. Come on now. Low flyer, low flyer, duck. Some of this unicorn turd. Let's resin fuchsia. Which I'm glad these actually work for what we do. Because these things are beautiful. My wife actually has them for her nail salon. So she she does nails for a living and manicures and pedicures. And she's like, you should try this stuff. I'm like, well, it's not acrylic. She's like, just try it. And sure enough, I try it, man. It's beautiful. And it works. Looks real nice. We're gonna have to evict that dude. He's gonna go bye bye. That's right. I have to walk home, little buddy. Little gold in here. A little squiggled around. Some of that mutant shift. Second shift after the aliens go home, the mutants take over. That's right, I'm telling you. Why else are you gonna name it Mutant Shift? What the heck? What's purple got to do with mutants? Are mutants purple? I don't know. Guess I haven't seen one, so I'm not sure. Bust in some of this little piggy sequins. Whoosh. Hey. 
turn off. This is the uh, this is the interference violet. That's what that was. I could see that starting to change the violet in front of my face. We do the same sort of thing. We're gonna drop a good good puddle of this opaque red right in the center, like I did the last one here, and then squiggle some out. Seemed like that helped that red hold them centers of the cells a little better. Oh yeah, that's magical back there. I'm just looking at the drying table, being amused with a woo. A little bit more of this this time. Just a little bit more. Don't take much. We'll run the torch quick before I put this white cell activator on. I have to hit this couple of dudes with this here skewer. They don't want to leave. Oh, see what I'm saying? Oh, man. Uh oh. Well, we'll see if it works. If it don't work, scraping this one. I hit it with the torch a little too close. The whole spot right there is like dry. <clears throat> the skin of it is dry. <clears throat> we'll find out. It might look out nice. working out so far. I definitely have to let this one collect. That one's going to take a little bit. Blow out some of these boring spots without cells while that collects underneath there. I'm going to try to tip it at the same time. I want this to kind of filter this way. go yes indeed getting the same sort of beauty that that last coaster was that's right we'll give you a little look you see mm -hmm. oh that might actually even be better my goodness time to draw some hearts that's what i talked about i'll point this out here if i can find my skewer so i try to use these little spaces right here there's no cells. There's no coolness going on. Now, don't get me wrong. Those colors are cool. But then I'll draw a little heart by making a little sort of a figure eight swoosh. And once you do that last little swoosh, it turns it all into a nice little heart or a leaf, I guess some people would call it. But I do that in most of these little spots here that are really boring. And I try to come up just barely inside the line where the cells start and pull it out. Pull it out. That's that's just what I do. But this is looking nice. Get a, so we draw our, make sure you're still in the camera here and draw our little hearts. That purple mixes so nice with that black cell activator. That uh, interference violet just consumes that black and makes it the coolest purple. It's a deep dark purple. Draw my hearts all around this edge, and like I say, sometimes they get thrown off the edge, but a lot of times at least one really good one stays in a nice spot, and I've heard too many comments, look at the heart. <laughs> of course, you gotta love your painting. You gotta love what you do. 
love what I do. Yeah, there's a nice one right there. <clears throat> that one's actually going to stay there too, I can tell. So we're all, when I tilt it like this, we're all moving at the same pace. I don't want to hit it with torches. Uh, I got too close, it was a mistake. I'm going to hit these bubbles with this uh, skewer quick. Only a couple. I don't know if I want to mess with this one. Okay. It's telling me I gotta torch it really fast. I'm further away. I got way too close. And there we go. Medium ish spin. I definitely need some of this paint that's in the middle of there to get out of there. This is gonna be a little bit of a long one, too. I mean, I hope y'all don't mind. I mean, I don't mind making this beautiful stuff. Give it another spin counterclockwise. We'll probably leave this one alone too. I'll, I'll do a little outro, like the pack in the last video. I, like I said, I wasn't allowed to because I accidentally hit the camera. But we'll do a little outro for today. Hope all you come on back, check out my stuff. <clears throat> Yeah, I'm actually taking my artwork and I'm, I've already started a line of clothing. So this line of clothing has my artwork on the entire like dress or t-shirt. takes up the entire thing. It's not like a little... I have somewhere it is a little square in the middle of the shirt. But most of it, my artwork is the whole entire piece of clothing. So you get this beautiful stuff and you get to walk around in it. Yeah, that's... <clears throat> I got some top notchers here right now. I'm telling you that. I'm going to take you. I'm going to give you this little look here. Man. Well, let's see what you're seeing, hopefully. Hopefully it's as good as my eyeballs are. Because that's... Yeah. Yeah. We'll spin around here. We don't got to do a flyby. We'll do a spin around. <laughs> but that's... Man. That's that textbook stuff. That's what that is. That's a good stuff. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna put that magic over here on the drying table. Like I know they're gonna dry good. I can already tell. And then I'm baffled at that beauty. It's beautiful. <clears throat> I hope you like the content. I hope the video before this one of me mixing everything all made sense. If something didn't make sense, let me know. Hopefully this was entertaining enough. If you're an artist, I know I, I I don't just watch the videos to the end. I always do. I gotta see that beauty. You take that like button. Just give her a little love. Unless you absolutely can't stand it, that's fine. I've, I've seen a few of my videos, 200 views, four likes. That's all right. I, they won't tell me what I'm doing wrong or what they want, but all right, I'll improve. Gotta get me a little bit of time set aside to work on my channel. But you take that like and little love to that. If you haven't subscribed yet, do some subscribing. All You're just going to see more of this, what I'm doing here. And I'll see you on the next one. Y'all have a beautiful day.